This past weekend, I had the chance to check out the annual Greek festival held at the Annunciation Greek Orthodox Church in Akron. The festival is three days long, Thursday through Saturday, and has things like Greek food, Greek culture, Greek dancing, and celebrates the Greek faith. I had the chance to speak with Father Jerry Hall, the pastor at Annunciation Greek Orthodox Church, about the festival and the importance of it to the community. This is our annual Greek festival that we um, have each year in the fall, we open our doors to the community, sharing uh, Greek food, Greek culture, Greek dance, and uh, the Greek Orthodox faith. Well, the, the festival is important because, um, as I said, it's an opportunity for us to open our doors to the community, and it's also an opportunity for just the community, to, our community, our parish community, come together to work together on a on a big project, and so. Sometimes people really um, have an opportunity to get to know somebody that they work side by side with for you know a day or three days during the festival, and it really builds some relationships in the in, in the community as well that people might not have that opportunity to spend that kind of time with uh, their fellow parishioners uh, just coming for services on a Sunday. He says that the festival is going on its 61st anniversary and it started at the storefronts in downtown Akron. The church was founded in 1916 and it started in the downtown area. We just celebrated our 100th anniversary a few years ago and uh, we started um, in the downtown area for, um, for the first 10 years. They were sort of in a, in a house on Summit Street and then uh, we built this location um, started making plans in 1927 and by 1930 they had moved into uh, this facility uh, which was a little bit different then. Um, we expanded it in the early 80s to increase our seating so um, made some changes over the years. The festival is huge and it has so much to do there. People have an opportunity to come in and uh, see what the interior of the church looks like. We have church tours. Um, so have some demonstrations of Byzantine music and um, talk about the iconography and our, and our Orthodox faith. Some of the uh, specialty items that we have in the terms of pastries, the famous one that everyone thinks about in terms of the pastries is baklava. Uh, we also have a, an excellent like custard-filled filo uh, pastry that's very sweet. It's called Galacta Burico, that's, that's excellent. Uh, the uh, parish ladies made 14,000 of these sort of braided butter cookies that we call guladakia. Um, so those things are available. Uh, we have gyros, uh, souvlaki, these are called pasticho, called moussaka, Greek style chicken, and, and, and of course uh, lamb as well. Besides food, dancing, bands, and faith, they also have vendors like sisters from a convent in Pennsylvania handmade chocolate vendors, jewelry vendors, and a flea market type setting. Overall, the festival was so much fun and I can't wait to go back next year. Reporting from ZTV's Lights, Camera, Akron, I'm Jay Goldgott.